ETN is one of the best heroes in the game with his global counter detection and a very strong mid game, but his targeting options are confusing and the wrong choice can cost you. At the start, ETN will only have one drone and it will attack whichever balloon is furthest along the track. It is not until level 7 that he unlocks the first two targeting options. At this point, you can choose between first or divide and conquer. First is pretty simple, every drone ETN has will attack the balloon that is furthest down the track, but Divide and Conquer does something cool. ETN's first and fourth drone will be set to first, while the second and third will be set to strong. This can be helpful if there are some stronger balloons that you want to weaken up before the rest of your defenses, but typically you want to keep them on first. Then, at level 11, he unlocks the final targeting option, which is Zone Defense. This will set his first drone to first, second to strong, third to last, and fourth to close. And if you are ever wondering what each drone is set to, you can just look at the colors on top of them. Blue means first, yellow is strong, green is last, and purple is close. Unfortunately, zone defense is the worst of the bunch, with divide and conquer and first being much closer, but the general consensus is to keep ETN on first like most other towers. What do you call a monkey that never shuts up? A blaboon.